If you're new here, my name is Alexa and I am a sophomore at Harvard University, currently living on campus, and I thought that I would show you my dorm. Originally, it was supposed to be a double, but because of COVID, I got this entire place to myself and it's pretty sick, so I thought you guys might want to see. If you're interested, stay tuned, and if you want to have more bonus content, vlogs, that kind of stuff, then check out my Patreon, which is linked below. All right, let's get into it. So I guess we'll start at the beginning, right? So you walk in the door. I live right on the first floor, which sometimes is nice, sometimes it's not. And then there's my hand sanitizer. It's perfect. For COVID purposes, we'll just get that out of the way because I know you guys are least interested in that. I have two COVID bins. So there's this one and then this one. And I put all of my COVID related like stuff in there so a mask that I need to wash. There's some of my shoes. I keep my like travel hand sanitizer there and that's the ID. Hydrogen peroxide and microban right there. And then I have some clothing wipes and all of my masks and gloves and that kind of stuff right here. But you don't care about that, so let's just pretend that that's not there, and we'll move around. I got this nice little poster, it says Winchester Bros, and my friend Gabby got that for me. With a calendar that you'll see a little bit later. Here we have my textbooks and things. I have a class with Steven Pinker, I have classes on uh, medieval queens, that kind of thing. Here's my psychology book. I have my Brita filter thing with like a nice little crack. I don't know how that happened. There's a stack of Girl Scout cookies back there that my uncle got me, and I finally just opened them. So I'm just gonna go put these on my desk. And whoa, we're at my desk. We may as well look at my desk, right? Here we've got my whiteboard that has all of my classes. I have no class on Friday, which is actually fan-fucking-tastic. And then up here I just got some random stuff. So I have ADHD and I saw this really smart thing on the channel how to ADHD about making a dopa menu so little activities that you can do if you're in need of like stimulation so I have a list of those things there and then this is just some random doodles that I did that I thought were like entertaining to look at so I just put them up there and then we have my desk this is a book that I'm currently supposed to be reading for my Histon Lit class history literature the one on medieval queens this should go in this drawer actually in a little bit. We've got my laptop. This has been featured in many a video. I've got this giant block thing for my outlets, which is really nice because I can just plug in a bunch of stuff. It never gets overheated, but the problem is because there's this big cord here, I can never shut this door fully, so that does bother me, but you know, I gotta live with it. I got these shelves on Amazon. I will leave a link to them in the description if you're interested. So I have this light. This speaker actually totally sucks. I got it for like a prize at post prom senior year of high school. It's the worst. Everything sounds distorted, but I just keep it here because I didn't bring any other speakers with me because I thought that one wouldn't suck, but apparently. This is the hand lotion I'm currently using. It's not my favorite, but it's not my least favorite. I got my lip balm. I have this stapler I got from Target, and then I think I got this tape dispenser from Walmart. I've featured this in a few other videos. This is my cow cup from the Ben & Jerry's factory. This is my coffee mug. It's got Hermione and Belle on it, which is so cute. You can see I have a pack of gum because I chew on things and I think it's better to chew on gum than my lips. <laughs> Fidget cube, ADHD staple, push pins, paper clips, clippy thingies, um, and then random stuff. And this is my adapter for my laptop in case I need to put a mic into my actual laptop. This stays in here. I have these cute little birthday dinosaurs that I got from my friend Gabby, who also made those wonderful pieces of art that you've seen. For my birthday, I've got my water bottle, which is technically tiny but too tall, but it's a fake Hydro Flask. I've got some stickers on it. It's pretty cool, but I tend to drink from the cow cup because it's easier to clean, so that just stays there. I'll put my little dinosaurs back. I've got this mug over here that I got from the Chris Kindle Market in Chicago when I went there two years ago around Christmas time and I've got all of my highlighters and colored pens. I really, really like these highlight pens, the Precise V5s. I think these are so freaking underrated. And then I have these highlighters that have like the clear tip 
and they're really nice. I'm gonna be doing a video on how I study, so if you're interested in seeing how a Harvard student studies, stay tuned for that. Got my random sticky notes because sticky notes are my life. Um, I get distracted on things. I have a Neo pen, oh, which I got from the academic accommodations office. I haven't set it up yet, but basically it's a pen that records audio as you take notes. So if you're someone that tends to space out all the time, this can be really helpful. I also have my Kindle, which I have a lot of my um, textbooks and stuff on too. So this is just a coupon for a free gift because I ordered a giant body pillow that I'll show you in a second. And then this is my a doodle book that I have. There's some like really old doodles in there like from several years ago. I decided to try to start a bullet journal and then I kind of just stopped using it, but it's still there in case I want to do it. Do you notice how I've like cleverly hid that disgusting paper underneath my Kindle so you don't even notice? This is the Supernatural calendar I was telling you about my friend Gabby got for me. This is actually my first time ever appropriately using a calendar and like keeping up with it. This one just says, Dean says eat more pie, join the hunt if you want to see my reviews for Supernatural. Um, stay tuned for the ones that are coming for season 6 through 10 and 11 through 15. I've already done reviews on the final episode of Supernatural and seasons 1 through 5. It's just some sayings and stuff from the show and like at, on their birthday months and stuff we get some of the characters and whatever. Because this is supposed to be a double, I have two beds in this room. So this is bed number one. Woo! I don't actually sleep here. I consider this like my lounge bed or where like a couch, I guess. There's just some under the bed storage that's not important, but this, woo, is what's important here. So I've got this really cheap sheet set that I must have spilled pizza sauce on um, from Amazon. If you're interested in any of the things that I did buy on Amazon, I will be leaving links in the description for you. I just bought this to go with the overall theme. I got this blanket for Christmas from my grandma, ordered some like throw pillows and these covers just to make something nice to lean on. Just got this body pillow which is where I got that coupon thing from. It is the softest like Sherpa cover ever. I love it so much. I have this cat pillow which is similar to like the Neko Atsumai cats and then this Taylor Swift folklore blanket that I got for my birthday from my grandma as well. So she got me both of the throw blankets here. I love it. It's so soft. Um, and then over here I have my birthday presents to myself which are from the website Belzy. Nothing in this video is sponsored by the way so all of the links are just links. But one of my favorite animals is the elephant so I bought myself an elephant and I thought the piggy was so cute too. The only problem is this part, like this thread, came undone like the first day I had it. So both ears are supposed to be like this, but this one isn't. And I don't have thread, so I haven't fixed it. But they just chill over there. Then we have my tapestry, which I got this from Society6. I really love this tapestry. It actually inspired one of my short stories that I'm currently editing and want to try to get published. It's very wrinkled. <laughs> and I kind of expected the wrinkles would fall out if I left this hanging for long enough, but apparently not. I don't know. It's just so weird. Don't you guys think? Like, look how weird. Like, there's eyes and, like, there's little hands coming out of the flowers. It's so cool. And I think the magical vibe of this goes so well with these little art pieces that my friend made for me. It just works so well. Also, I didn't show you guys my Gryffindor banner. I get the wizardry box from Loot Crate. So that's this part. Um, Harvard gave everybody a fan. So I have a Dyson. It's currently not on because it's really fucking loud, but this is just for the purposes of not spreading COVID molecules everywhere. And then if we go over here, this is my other dresser. So this is where I make coffee. This stuff is just some from the most recent wizarding box that I actually haven't gone through. So I got like an umbrella, a luggage tag, and then a headphones case. So I'm just going to move these over there for now. I have my fake Keurig. I actually got this for free also from Post Prom. Creamer. I just French vanilla. I'm a basic bitch. I used to have three mugs, but then I broke one of them. So I have this Accio coffee one that's like holographic. Look at that. Woo. And then I have this cappuccino mix that is from Sam's Club and I highly recommend it. It's really fucking good. And then my coffee of choice is Cafe Bustello and I have like reusable pod thing so that's great. 
Then I have some reusable straws that my grandma got me for Christmas, I think two years ago, as you saw over there. In the Zistresser, I have my clothes. So this is like my underwear, my socks, my pants, and my belt is gonna stick out from there. It's nice. I, I literally only own one belt. <laughs> Can we please? Thank you. This is like workout stuff and then random stuff, so like cleaning swabs and stuff are in there. And then this is all my sweatshirts. So I'm currently wearing my Harvard hoodie, but under here in this store I have all a bunch more. So this is like Taylor Swift one, Taylor Swift one, Taylor Swift one, um, Harvard one. <laughs> I stole this from my friend Gabby, who I've now mentioned a bunch of times. Harvard one. Zoom University one, so all of my hoodies and crewnecks go in there. And then in this dresser, I've already showed you the mask one. This has like hats and scarves and the couple scrunchies that I decided to bring and my bandanas in this one. Um, it also get like this drawer gets stuck though, and I know oh, it bothers me, but oh well. This is all my snacks and whatever. So I bought like a huge pack of oatmeal. I have some blended vanilla latte stuff that I haven't yet opened. Some like with popcorn, some candy, all the good shit. And here are just like cups and stuff. I used to keep them on top of this, but then I just didn't like the way it looked, and I had an empty drawer, so I just shoved those in there. They change color like with temperature too. So these are like for hot things. These are for cold things. And then this is my other mug that broke. It says no coffee, no worky. I got this actually from an abandoned school. Got it on the ground and took it home. It's like slightly broken and I don't really know how to fix it. So it just kind of stays in there now. And then down here I just have like cleaning supplies, COVID tests. And then over here is just like the cooking station. Woo! This um, night bus tin actually. I got from the Wizarding World, and it's so cool. I probably should have it turned this way because it fits microwave popcorn perfectly. So the only ones that you saw in that drawer were like excess. Anyway, over here, just got some dishes, silverware, that kind of thing. Harvard gave us the fridge and the microwave, so like I didn't pay for that. Got these cool sticky notes from the Wizarding World box, and then this is just my fridge. Also, I've got this closet over here. So there's my shoes, there's my tripod and stuff over there, my purse, um, which I don't really use because I freaking hate purses, and then like my actual jackets that aren't sweatshirts. Yeah, and then there's my filming stuff up there. So now I guess I'll take you into my bathroom. That's right, I have an in-suite bathroom all to myself. This is the whole thing. Oh, there you are, hi. Over here, got my blow dryer, my hair products, my uh, electric toothbrush that I guess I also got from my grandmother. Noticing in this video that I got a lot of stuff from my grandma. And this window completely like opens to the outside, so that's really uncomfortable because like obviously I want some privacy, but sometimes I want the window open, so I don't know. Here's my sink. My soap of choice is the soft soap antibacterial. If you want to see, I guess, my skincare routine, I did a video on that, so I'm not gonna go too in depth here. This mirror has like weird like rust underneath the glass, but it's kind of annoying because sometimes I'll be like looking cute and want to take a selfie, but then this is in the way. And then I just have some more like skincare and like paint meds and stuff in there. This is my makeup remover cloth. I use that instead of makeup wipes. Washcloth, recycling bin, cleaning supplies, toilet, my regular towel, and then my microfiber hair towel, and then into the shower. It's kind of messy right now, actually, because I deep conditioned my hair yesterday and haven't put it back. And now we go to my bedroom. I actually don't have batteries for these dangling lights um, because I am an idiot and ordered triple A instead of double A. So these are just plain lights, but these two ones get tangled all the time. There's my plant. Usually it doesn't live there, but she needed some light, so she's there for right now. Speaking of she's, ignore her tank because she needs to be cleaned out this week. You can't even see her. I have a gecko. Oh, there she is. Right there. Her name is Dandy, like fine and dandy. This is the where I actually sleep. I've got another cat pillow. These are Harry Potter sheets. I sleep on a satin um, head cover actually for my hair. And then hot tip by the way, if you guys want to have a really comfortable bed, take a giant throw soft blanket and put that over your sheets and sleep on top of that. I've been doing that for years. I've got my other tapestry here. More lights that are really cool but I'm dumb and didn't get the right <laughs> batteries so whatever. Then I have this little like 
bedside thing that my grandma made for me a few Christmases ago. So there's like all these pockets and stuff and it's really cool. So currently the physical book that I'm reading is Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. So I just keep that there. This usually is where I tuck my glasses in this one. So it's actually empty right now, but I'll put my bedside water bottle there. I have a journal there and it's pretty neat. Hello again. This is my closet where I keep my clothes. So I have it separated by color and type. I like to organize that way. So these are all my long sleeve shirts organized by color. These are my button up shirts organized again by color. And then like short sleeves also organized by color. Back here I have extra bags for my garbage, my extra soap down there, toilet paper, an extra chair that I got from Harvard, towels, laundry, that kind of stuff. You don't really care about that. And then this multi-part mirror actually I also got from Amazon and I really like it because it's you can just like disconnect it it's just actually four different squares so you can really make it like a custom mirror and I will also link that down below we've got my nice little garbage can and my two different shelves so this one is like where I keep my makeup and my gaming stuff so so I have my brush thing I started painting it and then I didn't finish it so we have this weird random like it looks like it's almost cool, but then I didn't finish actually making it look good. Um, then I, this is all my foundation brushes and my eyeshadow stuff. If you want a more in-depth video on the makeup that I brought, let me know. So I just have most of my makeup on this shelf and then like eyeshadow palettes there and like my lipstick there, but I'm not gonna go too into it. Perfumes and stuff, ADHD meds in the morning, um, sleeping at night because your girl doesn't sleep. And then down here, I've got my gaming laptop, which is an Asus Republic of Gamers, um, my Switch, gaming headphones, that kind of thing. If you're interested in more gaming videos, make sure to check out my Patreon, where I will be posting gaming videos. I've been really obsessed with Assassin's Creed Odyssey since coming to school. In only six weeks, I've played 90 hours of it, which is really bad. This is my hamper. Here's my necklaces. I got a bunch of these, like, mini hooks, and then just hung up my necklaces from there. This is another poster that came with that calendar. Welcome to hell, supernatural themed. Over here, we've got some self-care kind of stuff, so like vitamins, moisturizer, extra lotion, that kind of thing. And then my jewelry that I brought with me, so some earrings, a couple rings, that kind of thing. We've got my art and reading stuff. So this is my art bag that has graphic paper, that kind of stuff. Color pencils right there. This is my actual sketchbook. I'll give you a quick flip through, but just don't fucking judge. There are so many pieces of art that I haven't actually finished. One of the paint by numbers also that Harvard brought us. And then there's some books here. So these are some other books, physical books that I haven't read. They'll be the next ones after I finish Got a Little Fire. Got my Ouija board, which is super cool. I got some incense, that kind of thing. Some like witchy stuff because for a while I was really obsessed with that. And then I haven't looked at it a single time since I've been here because ADHD hyper focusing is super fun. And I think that's my entire room. So I'll do like one of those fancy, ooh, maybe I'll put some fun music over top of this. Do. Da, 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 da. This is what we got. I hope that you guys enjoy this video and um, if you have any more requests for things like this, let me know and I will probably make it. I don't want this to be a completely Harvard related channel, but thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like. Let me know what other videos you want to see. And as I've mentioned several times in this video, if you want to see bonus content, gaming videos, vlogs, random shit, check out my Patreon. You can help me out for only a dollar a month and cancel any time. It'd be super cool if you would do that. Otherwise though, just give me some attention in the comments or likes because YouTube does not like small creators. I wish that this wasn't a disgusting mirror because then this could at least be kind of cool, but yeah. Bye! I just realized that I forgot to show you guys this, so I'm gonna quickly do that. Um, I'm kind of late for class actually to make this, so I hope you really appreciate this. These are all my school notebooks for all of the classes that I'm taking. I've got these pens. They say they're pastel. They're not pastel. They're neon as fuck, but they're really good pens otherwise. It's just misleading label. And then in this next one, I've got some more school stuff, and then because I'm well, I'm doing a lot of snacks down here. So I've got index cards. These are some Sharpies, extra staples, extra pencils, label maker, post-it notes, tape, that kind of stuff with snacks. Easily accessible. And then down here, I just have random text stuff. So extra cords 
and batteries and that kind of thing. Not super interesting. Okay, I actually have to get to class now, so I hope you guys enjoy. Bye!